Hey everyone, welcome to another Python programming video where today I'm going to go through the if, elif, and else statements. So this is kind of a decision-based feature in Python where it will loop through and based on the input or information in the program, it will print out certain scenarios. So I'm going to create a variable called number and it's going to be an integer. I'm going to ask for an input and I'm just going to say in string, enter a number. So if I have it being an integer, it's meant to receive an integer, not a string or any other form. So the if statement can be structured as the first one being if, and I'm going to say if the variable, which is number, is less than or equal to 25, we'll print out a statement saying the number is less than 25. Following if is something called elif, which is a, another scenario that can be considered. For this one, I'm going to do in parentheses, number is greater than 25, and in parentheses again, number is less than or equal to 50. And that will categorize the variable and print out the output number is greater than 25 and less than 50. So it's accepting various inputs and printing out different statements. I'm going to do another elif and this is going to be if the number is greater than 50 and if the number is less than 75. So based on the user's input, the program will print out a certain string. So there's if, which is the start of the if statement, elif, which is kind of like the middle of the if statements, and then the very last one being else. Else is if everything previous is false, it will print out this else statement no matter what. So if anything is less than 25, between 25 and 50, 50 and 75, it will have a certain statement, and if it's above 75, the else will run and it will print out numbers greater than 75. So let's print out some numbers here. So let's say we just do 20, number is less than 25, that works. Let's make sure every other scenario works. So let's try 45 and it's saying it's greater than 25 and less than 50, which is working. Let's try um, between 50 and 75, which is, let's just try 60, there we go. And lastly, let's try to make sure that the else statement will run if we print out and input a number greater than 75. And there we go. So that's sort of a walkthrough on how you can utilize if statements, which considers if, elif, and else. Make sure to like and subscribe for more content, and I hope you guys enjoyed. See ya.